other tool we have with us, um, just to give you an idea of where we are, is um, <clears throat> a thermal infrared camera. This one from Drega uh, is a, a super uh, duper camera which is able to have a very high uh, temperature resolution and also fairly high spatial resolution. Uh, the reason why we're using those things is, for example, we not only want to look into the, uh, for example, uh, you know, electronics problems where we can detect problems uh, with the camera, but also uh, into geological processes. Now, this kind of tools is usually used by firefighters uh, to save lives, to find people in a burning building, for example. What we're looking at is um, our temperature differences, difference in temperature variations in the soil to detect, for example, caves or, for example, to follow uh, wind dust, dust devil tracks. We don't know if this is possible, uh, but realize with, with things like this, the UCF 9000, for example, they're, they're so well developed, they're so ruggedized, they're so useful for the field that they can also be used for research activities. designed a deployable shelter for emergency cases on Mars expeditions. Um, it is a shelter that on an EVA, so on an extravehicular activity, when there is an emergency case happening, like when a spacesuit doesn't work anymore or when somebody gets hurt and they can't return to the base the same day or immediately, so they have to put up the tent to have an atmosphere they can breathe in so they can put off their helmet and wait until somebody comes and takes them back to the, to the base. The deployment is very easy um, according to the astronauts and even the sitting position is very comfortable. There are some adjustments we have to do but in general it's working very, very well.